When Jesus resurrected Sunday morning, 2,000 years ago, he did something some of his followers have a hard time understanding to this day. For some reason, after Jesus arose from the dead, he folded the napkin that was about his head. The Lord made sure in the written word to tell us that the napkin was neatly folded and placed at the head of that stony slab. His body was laid on Friday evening just before sunset. Why would Jesus make it a point to share such a thing as this in the Bible? In order to understand the significance of the folded napkin, you have to understand a little bit about Hebrew tradition of the day. The folded napkin had to do with the duty of the servant as is dictated by the actions of his master. This was taught to every Jewish child for thousands of years and it most assuredly speaks of a truth we as Christians today can embrace. When the servant set the dinner table for the master, he always made sure that it was exactly the way the master wanted it. The table was furnished perfectly each and every time the master sat down to eat. As he ate his meal, the servant would wait just out of sight until the master had finished his meal so as to be ready to clean the table for him when he was done. As tradition dictates, when the master was finished eating, he would rise from the table, pick up the napkin, wipe his fingers, his mouth, and clean his beard. He would then wad up the napkin and toss it on the table. Doing this was the sign the servant watched for. He was taught that the wadded napkin meant, I'm done, you may clean the table. However, if the master got up from the table for whatever reason, with the folded napkin still beside his plate, the servant would not dare touch the table. He knew that the folded napkin meant, I'm not finished yet. I will be back soon. Now you know why Jesus folded that napkin. God bless.